Welcome back everyone. We have a lot of updates from the i3 that you can check out up here. If you want to know about the remotes, check it out. There is a lot of new stuff coming, right? Absolutely. DIY Photography's coverage of NAB 2023 is sponsored by Sennheiser, Jiayun, Small Rig, and B&H. We're back here with Ferdinand Wolf from DJI. Tell us what is going on with these remotes. There's so much I yes. see. You have plenty of control options now with the i3. Uh, thanks to our O3 Pro um, wireless transmission system, we also have more control options. So, first of all, you can use like the classic dual operator RC setup that most people uh, are used to. But finally, we now officially also support the master wheels. So, you know, there's still a lot of, you know, uh, senior DPs um, that prefer the wheels over the sticks. And you know, they have some advantages, depends on the scenarios. So you can connect the hybrid monitor wirelessly to the bird and then use the master wheels to control the gimbal, which is really, really sweet. And you also can use um, the Ronin 4D hand grips, which you can see here. And then you can use this little thumb stick to control the camera as well. We also support the three-channel focus unit, which will be soon available. Uh, so you can even work in a three-operator setup. Uh, master wheels, pilot remote, and the focus unit. So that's really cool as well. Okay, and talk to me about this remote, because this looks very different from what we're used yeah. to. So we're reusing um, our enterprise-grade uh, RC+, Plus, which is um, weatherproof. So you have closed gimbals, uh, everything is very nicely enclosed. You have a couple of buttons that you can freely map to several functions. You have a lot of you know, dials and wheels, uh, detachable antennas. Um, you have a very nice stand and we redesigned the harness as well. So you can um, work all day without putting too much stress on your neck or your back. Uh, we also now feature an external battery support so you can open up this and then you have a battery that you can hot swap. That's, so that's with good. With the internal battery, you have three hours or three and a half hours. With this, you have another three hours and then you can just hot swap it without even powering and it's, down. And it's in addition to the exactly. internal battery. It still works. You just pop in a new one and you have another you know, three hours plus. So you basically but, can leave it on the whole day. And you can also hot swap the batteries on the drone. So, so full time, full day. You don't have to power down anything anymore, which helps a lot. You know, if you don't want to uh, lose the signal, stuff like that. Um, yeah, what else is to say? It features a 1200 nits hybrid monitor, which is bright enough to work even in like a desert, super bright desert, uh, without uh, a monitor hood or shade. Uh, I worked for three months in, in Morocco without the need of that. And how is it with glare? Really good, so no issues at all. So this is really, really helpful, yeah. And I know we touched on it before, but I want to mention it again. Um, we can now have uh, the pilot and the camera yeah. operator in two different places. Yes. Tell yes. me a little bit more about... The pilot can finally freely run around, you know, and check, you know, the, the flight path and everything, where the gimbal operator can stay somewhere or also move around, because they each have individual links. Yeah, they, they don't interfere with each other. Uh, they can be separate on the set, and that is super, super helpful. Yeah. And why, why, why do we need a HDMI here? What can you do with that? Uh, so HDMI, you can output either the main camera image or the FEV camera image. So if you would like to add another monitor or top, like an external monitor, so you could um, output the FEV signal in full screen, so you have dual screen, or you can feed it into like a video system on set. Very cool. Well, awesome work with this. I see there's so many updates. I'm sure globe, uh, operators are going to be really happy to get Absolutely. their hands on these. Yes. So talk to me about price and availability for the remote. Remote's already available. Um, and um, the Inspire will be available end of June if you pre-order now. It will be shipped then. Uh, Inspire comes with the remote uh, and the whole set with six batteries, the camera, the remote, uh, one terabyte SSD is included as well, will be in $15,000. Oh, ready to shoot. Ready to shoot, yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. This has been DGI and Ferdinand Wolf, who's told us everything we need to know. 
Stay tuned for our more coverage of our NAB 2023 interviews. I'm Adam Frimmer from DIY Photography, and we'll keep you guys posted.